this is Kreis of thank you for watching my previous videos and welcome to my new video and today I will try something which I had no idea what the result will be because I just came with this idea but if I do something wrong you probably already will know how to find a way around it so I come with you guys and the idea is to connect this LED strip to my mouse because this is the old mouse in previous videos I mentioned it and I also said that you cannot unlock the button of the mouse but it wasn't true because when I uh, rip it apart I found out that under these pads you have two screws so if I take the pads out I can unscrew the bottom of the mouse and then I have access to the inside so I will try to make a LED lamp. If I plug it to normal charger, it shines. It's a steady current, so I hope it, uh, the, I will have the same result with this LED strip. The other issue which I might come across is the fact that this LED strip is 12 volt. And if I'm correct, this USB output for power is uh, up to 5 volts. If you use a supercharge, for like iPad devices and stuff like that, which I've seen it's on my motherboard, I can get up to 10. I so if I use a cable which has two USB and one output, that my, might have given me uh, 10 watts, and the LED strip is 12 watts. So even even then, I wouldn't have this uh, power and. Uh, I wonder if I connect it to this, uh, whether I get, get enough power to uh, to run it or uh, it will just shine, but uh, dimmer. So let's check it out and uh, I hope for the best. So here I have this uh, USB powered uh, hard drive, it's a SSD, and as you can see it has two USB 2.0, but it leads uh, to one cable, so probably this power adds up. I might be wrong. So if I cut this uh, out and then connect it to the LED strip, it should work, but I don't want to lose it, so I tried to do it with the cable from the mouse. And here it is, the inside of the mouse. As you can see, let this USB cable is attached to the mouse by four pin. It's men's type of uh, socket and this is a female type of socket. So if I plug those cables into this socket, it should light up my LED. And that's what I'm hoping for. The other, the another idea which would be interesting uh, to take this out and uh, have uh, drivers uh, for my LED light because this plate operates the mouse and the mouse has also software which is on the computer so it might actually work if I install the LED and plug it to this and then I can operate the LED light through the settings for the mouse but it's more advanced and I don't know if it's worth it. First, I want to check if this solution actually is uh, feasible. Now, here it goes. I plug USB cable into the charger. And if I write, now, if I put my cables here, my LED should light up. And it would be awesome because then I would make my own lamp. If you look closer, there are four cables here and I have hot four, four cables from uh, RGB. So the blue is blue, red is red in RGB, and uh, G is uh, green, and black is power. So if I mix those two, they give me different colors. So if I would join those two cables, red and uh, blue, it should shine pink or purple, something like that. It's, it's um, like what, with paints when you mix colors. So, the moment of truth, the moment of truth, and, and as you can see, it's not working, so, <laughs> I, could, I hope so much for it. So, 
Guys, do you have a solution for that? Is it, do you think it's power or, or what's wrong with it? Because right now I'm in a blue. Maybe it's the fact that it's uh, 5 watts and it doesn't provide enough energy. Maybe, okay, I'll try one more thing. I'll open this click and I took out plastic. So actually uh, this fits perfectly inside. So there's nothing wrong with it. I'm pretty sure it's the fact that I don't get enough power, which is sad. Okay, I'll try to figure out another solution without using this charger because it definitely seems like it's not powerful enough. Hey, so I had another idea and I found this 12 DC Canon charger, charger and this is 12 volt let's try so with if i'm entirely correct which i hardly are i'll try to take this shell out of the cables connect them all together and then touch the ending of my charger and it should light up and then it means that the led is good i'm doing my best but it still doesn't work thank you a lot for watching if you have any solution for that, please leave uh, it in the comments because I really want to make it work and uh, subscribe to see other videos and uh, wait till next week and uh, I'll try to find solution online and uh, make some progress on uh, my conception and uh, see you next time. Bye.